guys, so today I'm sharing with you my September julep box and they've changed their packaging and I love it. So instead of being wrapped up in a colored uh, like tissue bag or paper bag uh, and then being in the like, not cellophane, but like the plastic wrap you take off, this is what it looks like now. All three are packaged together and they just slide out either the top or the bottom, whatever way you pull them out. And again, they're in individually packaged containers. So I quite like this. Um, the colors I got this month are Josephine, uh, Kat uh, Katrina, I was like Katarina, Katrina, which almost matches my scarf, and Candace. So I'll do up close of them. Uh, this box, again, escaped me, and I wasn't sure I was going to get it, and then I'm happy I went through with it. They are such pretty colors. So here is the first one. So we're going with Candace. So Candace is kind of... It looks kind of like a black polish that's like filled with that gold glitter and stuff. Sparkles. It looks a little more bronze on camera, but I'll see how it swatches later. I'll have swatches um, in the next couple of days, probably tomorrow, up on the blog. So definitely uh, check down below. Uh, you can also check out swatches from the last Julep box. That's also on my blog as well. Here is Katrina, which is a nice bright yellow, but not as bright as Mellow Yellow from Sally Hansen, which I had on, uh, if you say, check out my Instagram, I had it on a couple of weeks ago, that's like a very true bright yellow, and this is bright, but it's more rich, I guess that's kind of the only way I can describe it, it's a little more on the mustard side than like bright yellow, and then last but not least, Josephine, which is kind of a teal color. Teal bordering towards kind of a grayish shade, but yeah, so I'm excited for these great fall colors. Uh, I think I'm going to do a manicure this week with these two. I'm thinking something like chevron or stripes. I kind of want to do some nail art because I've been living the boring life of one color and this needs to go because it is so chipped. But Anyways, that's pretty much it for that box. Um, so, as always, there is a link below to get a free Julep Maven box for your first month if you've never subscribed before. Um, each month, it's 20 bucks, and honestly, I think it's fabulous. I'm not subscribed to any other monthly service. No beauty products, nothing else. I just get my Julep box, and I love it. For me, I'm the It Girl, if you guys are new to my channel, and the It Girl always gets three nail polishes. The other boxes are two polishes and a product, like a related product, hand cream, uh, polish remover, different all the pro promo kind of items, but like good sizes, not like tiny samples. And they also now have a beauty box. I think that's the, Amer the American Beauty nail polish box now become the beauty box. And I have yet to try it. Uh, I always contemplate it every month. I'm like, should I just get this instead? But nail polish always wins. Uh, these polishes, if you were to just buy them by themselves, if you aren't a Julep Maven, are $14 each. So they're a little more expensive than even OPI. And I hate spending $10 on OPI. But for $20, getting three polishes. And they're always great quality. I've never really had a major issue with any of them. There's the occasional color that's a little more sheer. I like things to be opaque. I don't like having to use like several coats, but honestly, I get so much use out of them. And recently I've been using the Freedom Polymer Top Coat, and I used it on this manicure, and this manicure didn't chip for six days. And that's like a record for me, because my nails chip really easily. Um, so I'm definitely impressed with this. Um, I didn't use it a lot, because I don't usually do top coats, because they're just, I don't know, it takes even more time, and usually I'm in a rush when I hate my nails. But I will keep you guys alert to this. And also, just to let you know, I will have a product review up. Probably I'll do, a, I might do a video as well. Um, I got a new dry shampoo that I got. It's from got to be the got to be brand. Um, I don't use dry shampoo. I do the old school method of baby powder when I need to. But I'm excited to try that, and I'll have a review here. And I will also have a post on my blog about it. So be sure to check that out, and I hope you guys have a fabulous weekend. And don't forget, any other back-to-school or school-themed videos, leave them down below, and I'll try to get to them. Um, 
yeah, I have some ideas for um, a nail video, a makeup video, fashion video, not from back to school, more fall oriented. But yeah, so I will see you guys later. See ya!